Hi, I'm Ed Downs at Abercrow Incorporated, manufacturer of Pie Master turnover machines and dough rollers. You can see our machines on our website, piemaster.com. This is the first in a series of short videos to explain the operation and safety and use of the Pie Master Model SA21. Uh, there will be several videos uh, discussing each of the different systems on the machine. Um, I will try to keep it as short as possible and concise as possible. Uh, I'll start by letting you know that this is unscripted and I am not a professional spokesperson nor uh, a videographer. So uh, bear with me while I stumble through some of this and probably some uh, some lousy video at some times. My goal is, is to help you uh, understand this machine and how to get your money's worth out of it. Um, that being said, the SA21 has been around for decades. Its form has obviously changed quite a bit. Recently, we've had a substantial change. Um, its design was to fill the void between hand making folded pies and full automation. Full automation is a completely other game, uh, huge capital investments. Um, this machine is meant to fill that medium company to a small, large company uh, that needs to improve their throughput and, uh, and efficiencies. Um, it is USDA approved for meat contact and um, it uh, has been around, like I said, for decades. And uh, with some new innovations to it, it should be an even more reliable machine than it always has been. Uh, each of the tutorials we'll do will focus on individual systems uh, or a couple of systems combined. I, uh, I want to keep them short, like I said, so uh, you don't have to sit through a long video of each one. So we'll get right into it. Um, the SA21 is divided into six systems. It has a pneumatic system, an electric system, the fill system, the turnover system, the conveyor system, and a water spray system. Uh, the machine is electro-pneumatic, which means it is electrically controlled and pneumatically operated. Uh, we'll go through the components of each system in this video and basically what their function is, and then we'll break it down into the specifics of each of those systems. So uh, we'll start with the pneumatics and electric together. 